Hello everybody and welcome to the Super Nations mod. For those of you who are new, welcome to the channel as well. Um, this is going to be a tutorial video on how to install the Super Nations mod. Alright, so first things first, of course, you're going to have to be on the ModDB page. This is where I post all updates to the mod. Um, the link to the page is obviously down in the er, description. Um, but of course, if you're watching this video, you're probably already coming from the ModDB page. So the first thing you need to do is obviously download the mod. And so just go ahead and go to the Download Now button. And it should download fairly quickly. For me, it's going to pop up in this upper right-hand corner as soon as it happens. Um, there it goes. So five, four, three, two, one. Uh, so the mod is now downloaded. So you have the zip file. This is going to be just like any other normal mod. So of course you open up the zip, the zip file, whether you do it normally or if you have WinRAR, they should operate the same. Um, go ahead and click that folder and you should have these two, um, items right here. So you have the folder and then you have the .mod file. And so we're going to going to go ahead and do is open up your file explorer and go find your Victoria 2 mod folder. So usually this is going to be in your Windows C programs times 86 uh, will be under Steam, Steam apps. Uh, then you want to go down to common, Victoria 2, and then you'll go to mod. So this is your mod folder. So for me, I already have the mod in here. Oops, ignore that. Um, so we're going to want to do is go ahead and slide these over right into there. That was not what I meant to do. Cancel. <laughs> okay. Hold it in the screen. That's where my game goes. Um, so basically, once you have that mod downloaded, that's literally all you need to do. So go to Victoria 2, load up your game, and it should pop up right on the bottom here, Victoria 2 Super Nations. And what you do is click Start Victoria 2. And that is literally it. And so you have to wait through, of course, the loading screen, which shouldn't take too long unless you're already loading it for the first time. If you're loading it for the first time, of course, it's going to take a few, like a minute or two for it to unload everything. Um, but as soon as it lo completely loads, you'll be greeted with the startup screen. And that should be about it. All right, so of course, once you have the loading screen all up and done, you will be presented with the menu. So for version 1.40, um, the checksum should be I, U, J, C. So make sure that is correct. If it's correct, then you've downloaded the mod correctly. Um, if it's your first time loading up the mod, sometimes mods tend to have a different checksum the first time you load it up. So what you're going to have to do is just exit out of the game and reload it, and it should be correct. So that's pretty much everything. So anyways, thank you all for watching, and hopefully that helps. Um, give me feedback on what you think of the mod too. So anyways, thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. As always, please leave a like down below and consider subscribing if you like to see more content just like this, more frequent uploads. If you have any suggestions, go ahead and leave a comment down below, and I'll see you guys next time.